is good everybody it's Lunik B and I am back on Madden NFL Ultimate Team 15 all right and they have all pro packs on the market and they contain at least three golds or elite players and a mix of seven other player and team items I have some points left over from the uh, game changers packs which i believe to be the best packs in the game but first before we crack open this five because i'm not buying the bundle this time um we are gonna look at the new team of the week content they came out with another set once again and they're more than likely going to be doing this every week so on offense we have a 90 rated Jordy Nelson from the Green Bay Packers for the collection reward. He has 91 speed, 93 run route, 93 catch, 96 catch in traffic, 94 scat catch, 92 release, and 90 awareness. That is pretty beast of a card. And next we have Kirk Cousins right here, and he is 83 rated overall, 68 speed. 88 throw deep, 90 throw accuracy, 86 throw deep. He's a semi-good quarterback. I wouldn't be looking for him. And then next we go up to Bobby Rainey. He has 89 speed, 90 agility, 92 acceleration, 82 awareness, 88 carrying, 74 trucking, 90 looseness, and 89 back cut vision. All right, now we move on to Sammy Watkins. This is going to be a beast of a card. He is 6'1", has 92 speed, 94 agility, 80, 74 awareness, 79 run route, 90 catch, 84 catch in traffic, 89 spectacular catch, and 87 release with an overall of 84. Sammy Watkins looks like a player that I want. All right, and then we go to the OG original gangster Antonio Gates, better yet, A.G., he is a 86 rated tight end with 85 speed, 85 agility, 90 awareness, 80 route running, 92 catch, 85 catch in traffic, 92 spectacular catch, and 55 run block. And he is an 86 overall. Antonio Gates from the San Diego Chargers had a very big game this week. And lastly, you have a 80-yard touchdown collectible. And that looks like that is to Jordy Nelson against the Jets. Now we move on to the defensive collection, who is the reward is an 89-rated Chandler Jones. He has 82 speed, 78 awareness, 84 strength, 85 tackling, 95 power move, 77 finesse move, 90 block shed, and 86 pursuit and then we have Rolando McClain who made one hell of an interception if you haven't seen it go look at that against my Titans they beat him down whatever they got a good interception though they actually had a good game good for them but he has 83 speed 76 agility 77 awareness 92 tackle 87 block shed 78 strength 85 play rec and 93 pursuit and then we move on to Kyle Fuller the rookie from the Bears he had two interceptions last night against Kaepernick. He was, man, Kaepernick was messing up. But anyways, 84 ready card, 91 speed, 88 agility, 73 awareness, 64 tackling, 89 man coverage, 93 zone coverage, 86 press, and 78 play wreck. That is a pretty nice card. So we move on to the Bengals' George Ioka. I'm not sure if that's how you say his name or what, but he is a strong safety. He's 6'4 with 87 speed, 89 agility, 77 awareness, 71 tackling, 68 man coverage, 84 zone coverage, 89 press, and 77 play rec. That is a decent card right there. And then we move on to the Browns. They Tayshawn Gibson, 89 speed. 88 agility, 79 awareness, 80 tackle, 72 man coverage, 84 zone coverage, 78 press, and 80 play rec. He is actually a rated an 85, which is very interesting because those stats don't seem pretty good to me, but whatever. And then after that, you get the uh, return for a touchdown collectible, and then you get that collection. All right, but now that we're done with the Team of the Week content for Week 2, we are going to bust open some packs and see what we can get. Hopefully, you get some elites. I'd be okay with getting that Sammy Watkins or something like that, but we start out with Fernando Velasco, DJ Williams. We have another gold sneaking around in here, and I shouldn't say gold. I should say elite. We're going to look and go through the back, and we get a 79 Darnell Dockin. Not what I'm looking for. All right, so now we will go to the next pack. 
Starting with our second pack, we get a stadium. Looking for our elites. All right, so we get two silvers in a row, and then we get the gold Desmond Trufants. And we get Le'Veon Bell, the rising star, and an 82 football outsiders. Jason Verrett, we already have him. Let's go to another pack. All right, so we have three packs remaining, and we still have not hit an elite. All we got was a rising star and a football outsider that we already have. And then we got Montel, Montel Owens from the uh, Lions. Uh, and an 85 Orlando Franklin, which is actually a decent card. 85 rated right tackle. He's probably worth some coin. And I think we haven't got we, this is one more elite right here. Elite. All right. No, we get a 74 Bruce Carter, which actually he has some good stats. I think he has, uh, yeah, 91 acceleration. That's really important for a uh, for a linebacker. So he's actually a pretty good uh, budget card right there. If you're looking for a Bruce Carter, go ahead and out, go out there and go get him. All right, two packs remaining, and we still have not seen an elite, and we get a gold on the first card, and it is Jacoby Jones, and then we get Jordan Reed with our other golds, and now we're just scrolling through the pack. We're scrolling through the pack. We get Robert Griffin. That's all of our golds right there. These packs are not helping me out. Man, they're not giving me no love. All right, on our last pack, we still have not reached elites. And we're going to go ahead and get this one. Give me an elite. We're going to get an elite in this pack. I can feel it. Then we get Calvin Pryor on our first one. That's not who we wanted. But we're going to go back around and get our other gold right there. We get an 83. But we won an elite. And I told you, we got Jarrell Casey, the defensive tackle from the Tennessee Titans, my boy. I told you I smelt an elite. I smelled him. I can smell him. He was big and stinky, but I smelt him coming, man. All right, so Jarrell Casey, 6'1", 64 speed, 88 strength, 92 tackle, 90 block shed, 87 power on move, 77 finesse move, 80 play wreck, and 94 pursuit. All right, let me go and look at some of these other stats real quick. Just scroll through them. You guys can pause and see if you want him or what, if he has any hidden stats or anything. All right, so we got Jarrell Casey in Elite. We got him on our absolute last pack. We'll go and see what else we got right here. Nothing, but we got our Elite, and so that is a successful pack opening to me. As always, man, make sure to follow me on Twitter, at L-I-L-N-I-C-B, and shout out my videos and stuff like that. Shout me out, follow me, talk to me, conversate with me. But as always, man, make sure to leave a like comment and subscribe this is little nick b signing out